In this video, you are going to hear an authentic and full audio recording of Alton Way's execution. He was put to death by electric chair in 1989 in Virginia. This is one of four known recordings of executions made by the state. This video has become possible because in 2006, an 82-year-old former prison employee quietly handed over a briefcase to an archivist. This briefcase was kept a secret from his entire family. Inside were the four audio tapes. It would still take another 17 years, advocating by the inmate's family and a court battle by NPR to finally make them available. Something similar has already happened in Georgia with two execution recordings, which both are also available on my channel. This makes me wonder how many more secret recordings are in existence. People often expect electric chair deaths to be loud, but they are eerily quiet. Electricity is known as a silent killer. It cannot be seen, heard, or smelled. As it passes within the body, it causes severe involuntary muscle contractions. No muscles are immune, including the vocal cords. This prevents screaming, voluntary movement, and sometimes even breathing. The state of Virginia's protocol for the electric chair was slightly different from other states. Typically, there are three cycles of electricity, followed by a five-minute lapse time for the body to cool down. In Virginia, there are two longer, more intense cycles, followed by a few-minute lapse time. This could help speed up executions. Alton Way maintained his innocence at the end of his life, calling his death a murder. And it's actually possible that he was right. He was convicted of homicide in the 70s when forensics was unsophisticated in many ways. There was zero physical evidence linking him to the crime. The only thing that police had was his confession, which may have also been problematic. During his appeals process, his lawyer used medical records to raise concerns about his brain damage and low IQ. He was also known to be intoxicated at the time of his confession. These are factors that have contributed to false confessions in the past. The jury convicted him in 10 minutes and chose death in just 25. Some jurors later cited Elton's previous convictions as a large factor in their decision. Turns out that 80% of the convictions brought up by the prosecution at his trial weren't real. The prosecutor was never held responsible for his fabrications. As if that isn't bad enough, there was evidence that linked Elton's cousin to the crime. This cousin claimed that he was asleep in the car during the homicide. Coincidentally, he went on to commit several similar crimes in the future. One thing that you will notice in this audio recording is that the prison employees had a lot of confusion. Through a big chunk of it, they kept changing the time by an hour. In fact, there was confusion across the board. It could be that they were ill-prepared or perhaps just flustered. Take a listen. Testing, one, two. Mine from the governor's office was open to 2241, is that correct? Okay. This is the execution of Alton Way. The date is August 30th, 1989. <laughs> 2253, test of chair completed. Before I just use 1054. 10, 10. Confused with yeah, well, that's fine. Whatever's comfortable for you. Right. Whatever's comfortable for you. 2254, going into the cell area to read court order. It's being read at this time. Okay. Court order is being read. <laughs> yeah, I can believe it or not, I can hear the back, I can hear uh, what sounds like Mr. Muncie's voice in the background. All right. 1056 court order has been completed. Okay. 1056 completed reading of the court order. 1057 unlocking the cell. 1057 unlocking the cell. Are you picking this up? Ten fifty eight inmate carried to chambers. I'm not bothering you, I'm repeating what you're saying so we get a clear clear shot of it. That's correct. Okay. 
1059, excuse me, 1058 being placed in the, being placed in the chair. 1058 inmate being placed in chair. At this time, he's also being strapped in. Uh, all the straps are being placed on him at the same time. In 1058, you may be in place in chair and straps applied. trying to get it. I would like to express that what is about to take place here is a murder. Um, did anybody else catch the rest of that? You didn't get it on. I and something about he doesn't uh, he doesn't hold that against anyone and he loves everyone. That's correct. I don't I forgive everyone and I love everyone. That's correct. At this time the head piece is being placed on the inmate. Okay. at this time the headpiece and mask is being placed on it. Headpiece and mask. Can you hear me? Yeah, you're fine. And I've got 11, I got about 11.58, looks like. We may have jumped. 11.59. 11.59. 10.59. 10 okay. At this time, at 11.59, the minister is saying a prayer. The minister is saying a prayer? Yeah, yeah, we're doing fine. Minister is saying prayer. Trying to talk though. Yeah, you're doing fine. Doing fine. You're coming through loud and clear. Eleven fifty nine, they're wiping the sweat off of his forehead, his arms and his feet. Okay. <laughs> Forehead, wiping sweat off forehead, arms, and feet. Correct. Okay. Eleven fifty nine. The key has been placed into the proper position. Key placed in proper position. And turned on by the warden and the nod. Execution is taking place. Okay. Eleven. Eleven even. Key placed in proper position. Warden nod. Execution is taking taking place. Eleven even. Okay. Eleven oh one. What was that? Second jolt. Second. Second. Second jolt. Okay.
Roger, 1102. 1102, completed. <coughs> we can hear a few protesters in the background. I just heard the first time I've heard anybody. Debbie Groom says she's heard them, heard them on and off for about 15 minutes, but that's just for your information. The last statement, as best I have it, Mr. Lawson, is I would, ex I would express that what is about to, to take place here is a murder. Um, I forgive everyone involved and I love everyone involved. That's the best that I can relate to what you told me of what he said. Yes, that sound about right? I don't hate anyone and I forgive everyone involved. I think that's what he said. Maybe the love thing was not in there. Yeah. Okay. I don't hate anyone. Anyone. I forgive. Yeah, we still here. Still here. Still here. Still holding on. Four shirt pulled back for examination by a doctor. Eleven oh five, doctor's examined. Eleven oh five, he has been pronounced dead. Okay, eleven oh five, doctor examined and pronounced dead. Okay. Eleven oh five, the curtains are pulled. Okay. And witnesses are leaving. And witnesses 11.05. Okay. Do you need anything else? I don't know of anything else. No. I'm going to get ready to go do my thing. That's it. You're great. Thanks. Okay. Get that.